Hello everybody, this is Chromos Girl 018 and this is part 5 of my co-op let's play of Dandelion which is brought to you and here is my guest. Hello everybody, it's me, Graylace. It's been a while since we've done this game, uh, but let's play this game and when I went to load the save for this, I found that I guess that somehow I got saved over or something happened to it or something because it was further back than we had recorded last so I had to go back and redo it to get it up to that cup too. The day we were supposed to. Or the day we it's, ended off on last. It's fine, but I blame you. <laughs> Man. Fair enough. It's my game after all. <laughs> now, we were going after uh, this little guy here, the little white rabbit. The the sexiest rabbit. Now, since it's the weekend, we can go out. <laughs> and you have to get more points with him. Since he's not up to 25. Yeah, we gotta go on our date, our pet date. Got multiple stamps. Yeah, Ooh. those are very, those are very hard to get. Okay, our pressure's up a little bit, and we can go in here. So, dang it! If only we can figure out where they're actually at in the room, instead of just an indication that they're in the room. Just randomly. At least it gives us something. Oh, he just gave me a uh, baby's breath. I would, I'm it. glad you know what that was. It said baby's breath, and then it said the actual name for it. Oh, okay. Anyway, uh, last in the last episode, if you guys have watched this series so far, uh, Jihei had a lit. There were some people trying to make Jihei into a stud rabbit. Tried to set him up with other female rabbits because of his unique sil uh, silver fur. Sounds we like a pretty good deal it. for it. Yeah, we weren't having it. I don't yeah, know. I think you weren't having it. I was perfectly for it. <laughs> well, Although our character our... wasn't having it. No, our character, like, this is my bunny that dates. <laughs> He's my stud. <laughs> no, I bet she wouldn't have said that out loud because then people would be thinking that she's crazy and trying to take the animals away for their safety. No, that that's not a thing that happens. At least I hope not. I say stupid things like that all the time. <laughs> oh, okay. Not being Come serious, around. of course. I, I'd like to put it out there. I've never act, I've never flirted with an animal in a serious way. I don't think I've done it. I don't think I've done it sarcastically either. <laughs> I don't think so. Anyway, let's take Jiyun out to the university. Anything else? Nope. No, oh, just garbage. Yep. This room is filthy. Yeah, you think that people would people leave, they would clean up after themselves. It's disgusting. Someone did leave a book, which I guess is good for us. Yeah, because it raises our uh, art stats if we use them. Well, we just straight up just stole somebody's art book, which I'm okay with. Actually, let me check. Uh, we already got it all satisfied, so we don't have to if we don't want to. Watch the park. Just go on another date with a rabbit. Man, I really want them to be human and for it to stop making the, these little date segments creepy. I know. Or they're not really that creepy. Yeah, if, they're, if people they're, were they're, watching, they would just think that you're just taking your pet out for some fresh air. Yeah, they're they're only creepy when I refer to them as dates. Yeah. They're they're mean because we don't take the other pets with us. He always looks so upset with us. I know. And considering what he is like when he's human, and understandable on that one. Oh, your your lines. Oh god. Give me a second. I need to enlarge the. Am I watching? Hey, Joan, wait up. Huh? I was on my way home when HJ called me from behind and handed me a black plastic bag. Uh oh. What's this? 
That's a good question. Usually what HJ gives me in black plastic bags is food. They're chestnuts. Chestnuts? Okay. I looked at the plastic bag and saw that it was full of chestnuts. <laughs> it's still summer. Where did you get so many chestnuts? It's not the season for chestnuts yet. <laughs> yes, that's the question. Oops. Hang on. Uh, I don't know how to go back. It's okay. I'll just make it up. I, he, tells I, me, he basically tells us that his mom was ordering food and she ordered too much. Oh, I actually knew that. That was in the demo. He just mom must have had a habit of buying too much food. This isn't the first time that he gave me food like this. Yes, it's super not because he's into you and he's trying to be nice. Clearly. I feel bad for always receiving things from you. Is this really alright? Of course. Oh, by the way, did you know that you can feed chestnut shells to animals? Huh? I heard that chestnut shells are healthy for their fur. I don't think that's right. Chestnut I shells? I have no idea. Animals actually eat chestnut shells? I never heard of it before. But will they be able to eat those hard shells? Uh, the shell has something called tannin contents or something, so it has a detox effect. Whitens the skin and makes their fur shinier. I hope he knows Animal. what he's saying on that. Well, I'm gonna look this up. Oh, wait, it's my line again. Darn it. Darn you, darn you, uh, what's his name? Hey he Jung? He Jay. He Jay. Uh, I also heard that women grind this to make na natural facial packs or something. That I've heard. Tin and contents. Uh, it's <laughs> Sorry, I'm switching it from big window to small window. Anyway, I heard rabbits love this stuff. Rabbits, hamsters, cats. I heard it's good for all of them. That perked my interest. Really? Really? But the shell is so hard, can you really eat this? PJ thought for a moment. After all, rabbits have such sharp, strong teeth for a reason, right? And cats, too. I think it's more a reason for cats on eating meat. Uh, yeah. Though, Matt, though, if it was squirrels, I can imagine them eating chestnuts, but rabbits? Well, rabbits I can, too, since they have the same kind of teeth. That makes sense. Squirrels eat acorns too, after all. Thank you, I'll use this well. By the way... Yeah? Uh, nothing. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> That's well, I can imagine either saying that or asking her out, is what he was trying to say. Yeah. He just hesitated as if he wanted to say something, but instead just smiled awkwardly. Will the animals really like this? So far, I've only given the pet food or vegetables. But it'll be a good idea to give them something new for a change. I'm home! The five animals rush towards me. It's already six in the evening. They must be hungry. But I feel bad for just giving them nothing but a bowl of chestnut shells. Perhaps it'd be better to add other things to it. Things that are healthy for them. <laughs> I was about to say, no, keep that window, keep that window it, open. Because I want to see if any of this is not good for them that she's going to add to it. I am looking for it. Opened the refrigerator and saw a lot of leftover ingredients. I think I heard somewhere that yogurt is good for cats. I don't think so. Then again, I don't know. So look up yogurt. And broccoli and carrots. I think broccoli and carrots are probably good for the rabbits at least. Probably. There are more ingredients in the fridge than I thought. I might as well make dinner for the animals with all this instead of giving them the usual food. Mm -mm -mm. How about mixing everything that might be healthy for them? I should put in everything that's healthy, plus the things that they usually like to eat. I swear, I just found a question that's basically from this game. <laughs> I mixed everything up in a large salad bowl. Right, I had <laughs> aloe juice in the fridge as well. I don't think aloe juice is good for them. Though I the could be wrong, I've never had rabbits. The, the first comment is, is this a Dandelion reference? <laughs> uh, internet seems to think it is. So aloe juice is okay? Or aloe juice? I was still looking up chestnuts. Oh. Well, look up yogurt and, ch and aloe juice. Sure. Because those are the things that I'm kind of iffy about, besides the chestnuts. Because the broccoli and carrots, they should be able to eat, at least the cats, anyway. I know the cats, the rabbits. Plus, she's putting in things that they actually eat, which I'm guessing includes, like, the 
vegetables, fruits. Don't know what other, I don't know what the cats eat, to be honest. Besides the cat food. Apparently people feed yogurt the, to their dogs? I can't find it for cats specifically. Oh. Chestnut shells, apples, carrots, yogurt, broccoli, aloe juice. Hmm. That's a bit... That doesn't look very appetizing. It may not look appealing to humans, but animals might like it. <laughs> hey guys, yeah. come and get it! Yeah, yeah. I put the bowl down on the floor. I can hear their footsteps. Meow! Ji Yoon start suddenly halted in front of the bowl. Why is he not eating? Is it because is it because he's not familiar with it? Ji Su, who arrived later, began to devour the food. Ah, he's eating. The rabbits also strolled into the kitchen and began eating. They seem to like it. Everyone's eating except for Ji Yoon, who's staring at the bowl. What a relief. I hope it tastes good. <laughs> oh dear. Ji Su licked the aloe juice and suddenly let out a strange sound. I don't think aloe juice is good for cats. Hmm. Uh, it seems to, it, it seems to be, it can be, but if you give them too much, it will just give them diarrhea. So, have fun, main char player character. Good luck. But what's wrong? Jisoo, are you okay? Jisoo backed off from the food and continued to gag. What, is it the aloe juice? Jisoo now had his back on the floor, twisting its body and kicking his feet. That looks disgusting, by the way. I agree. What? What should There's I do? It's just like there. She just straight up threw in an apple core. No, she threw in apples, but I'm guessing that Ji Yoon was the one who ate the apples. He likes apples. No, I, I want to believe that there was just an apple core that she just threw in. No, I think if she was gonna give him apples, she would have. Then again, I think she, if she was gonna give him apples, she would have cut and peeled the apple instead of just getting and throwing in a whole apple. I don't know. We we already know that she's not not good with this. Jisoo! The rabbit seemed just fine. Maybe the food wasn't right for cats? That would explain why Jiyun didn't eat it. I don't know the how you want me to... Still, the rabbits were still eating without a problem. <laughs> Jisoo, what should I do? Oh my gosh. Oh no! We killed Jiwoo! Oh no! body suddenly stiffened. His face turned blue and he collapsed on the floor. Oh no, Jiwoo! I'm willing to bet all the monies is just because it tastes disgusting. That would not surprise me considering, like I said, his personality. <laughs> Both Jisoo and Jiwoo have gotten sick. Oh no, oh my, what do I do? Who do I help first? What just happened? What's the problem? The chestnut shells? The yellow juice? <laughs> or is it the it ogre? A dozen other ingredients I put in there. What should I do? <laughs> I couldn't figure out what caused the problem since I put in so many different ingredients. It seems both Jisoo and Jiwoo ate every from everything in the bowl. I should take care of Jisoo first. He's throwing up, but wait, Jiwoo's passed out. No, before that. Stop eating, guys! I picked up the salad no, bowl from the floor. It's fine. They love it. There must be no more casualties. My food experiment ended up costing me one cat and one rabbit. <laughs> Strangely, Ji Hei and Ji Yoon seem fine. She's taking this in stride. <laughs> Ji Su, Ji Wu, I'm sorry. What caused the problem? I couldn't figure out the reason for this. And here comes a conversation with the animals. Uh, let me hang on. Let me save real quick. Because I did never, I never saved before. Yes, that would be. That'd smart thing smart to do, thing. or else I'll have to go through this again. Yeah. Jisoo, are you alright? I still feel sick. I think I'm gonna die. What was that? Well, at least you threw everything up and you're feeling better. The buddy here was really on death's door. Really come back, did come back from the dead. Shut up! <laughs> How can she even think of giving us something like that? She must be out of her mind. I agree, tiny bunny. Tiny spotty bunny. That's I, you. I don't remember who that is. The white rabbit. I, I, I think it was okay. That That's because you only ate the apples, young master. Yeah. How come those two rabbits are just fine? The small one only ate the apples, and the big one ate nothing but broccoli. They're <laughs> smart. Piggy eaters. It's better than eating and then throwing everything up. We should have a well-balanced diet, of course. <laughs> under the premise that the food is edible. You guys are carnivores. 
Bitch, why are you talking about this? Or like I do, I just don't eat everything. Oi, oi vey. He's Jewish? I have oi no vey. No, I think he's more... <laughs> I don't know. I, I just know that's uh, Yiddish. Oh. Oi, oi vey, noisy cats. I can't. Stupid owner, I'm so sick of everyone and everything. Angstiest hey. teen bunny. Are you going to keep complaining? The food giver is actually with the trouble of making something for us. I mean, yeah, it was a little dangerous, but it was about Disgusting. <laughs> making nothing is better than making poisonous food. Yeah. But she worked so hard to prepare it. You didn't even eat a thing. I wanted to eat more apples. I do truly appreciate her trying to take care of us, even if she's incompetent. Apples. <laughs> I didn't eat, but I thanked her from the bottom of my heart. He was hissing at her, wasn't he? <laughs> I don't know. He was hissing at the food, I don't know. I swear he was hissing at the picture. Yeah, I think it was, but I think he was hissing more at the food than at her. I get, that's probably fair. I would thank her too, when she makes something edible. Well, it seems like she's going, uh, taking more, more of, taking care of us only by obligation before, but she's become much nicer recently. Hmm, that's true. She wouldn't even have cooked for us before. I'm not sure you can call that cooking. True. Th things were better before. Now I even have to watch out what I eat. I think she's, che I think she's cheered up more because, basically because of your feet, Bunny. Yes. The, the, the paw pads. Shut up, furball. She she did change a bit. I, I think she's relaxed a little over time. That's good. And we've only got... Uh, how many days are August 30? Uh, we got 16 days, I think, before they... Okay, I'm almost there. Didn't even take the pets to the vet. Nope. Apparently it resolved on its own. Yeah. She just went, whoop, they're dead now. And then they weren't dead later. Oops. For shame. Sorry, June. Oh, it actually went down. It was 22 before. How could you? Sorry, June. We're trying to seduce the tiny white bunny. I didn't mean to do that. You need to give him all the scratchings. Just like how I you seduce a real man. I guess I found the wrong one. Yeah. Just just like with a real <laughs> and right Karamas girl. I don't know what I'm going for there. <laughs> I'll shut up now. Okay, we're almost there. We only got one more point, and we I don't know. Maybe I don't just... know what we got. I don't know what we got in the last episode, so I'm just going. I think just the stress resistance. We've got all our stats to a suitable amount, I think. Huh? What's this? A radiation blocker bracelet? What? Anti magnetism bracelet. Where the heck Where did he, did he that? get this from? It's not common. He must have bought it. Brought it because he's worried about it. <laughs> he bought it. <laughs> Tiny little bunny. He hopped over with a bill, with a dollar bill in his mouth, and then hopped away with a bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny to actually see someone interact like that with a bunny like that. I think if an animal came into like a store where I was working and had money, I'd just be like, "Okay, sure, just just take your things. Good luck, good luck, tiny bunny." <laughs> okay, nothing there. Just trash. Or gar or leaves and stuff. It's not exactly trash in the park, but there was, like, lint. Yeah, it looked like lint and thread. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, we took them to the beach. Some oh, the I beach see. Just packed with people. Are That's we taking all of them yeah. this time? Yeah, this, oh. is a, this is actually a cutscene thing. Oh, it's a group date. Yeah. High school students on their scooters, people from other countries taking sun baths, families on vacation. It'll probably be just like, it'll probably be like this until the beginning of September too far away. I can see the crashing waves into the beach umbrella that I rented. 
want to go into the water, but I have to stay, take care of the animals. I could hear people screaming whenever a big wave came. I really feel like I'm away on vacation. It's been such a long time since I was out like this. I haven't gone on vacation since I began to live alone. I visited the beach only once when I was young. Mom didn't want to go into the water because she was afraid of getting tan, and I played with Dad instead. It's before their dad, their, her parents got divorced and when her mom began to change. I see. So her mom, I guess, was actually nicer when her dad was around. Yeah, they talked about that. I don't remember too well. It was such a long time ago. Back then, Mom was smiling. Mom was so beautiful and nice when she was younger. Meow. Jihei and Jiyun are sitting under the shade looking at the ocean. Jibu hasn't even come out of the basket. Jisoo and Jiyun are running around in the sun. Actually, Jisoo is chasing Jiyun, and Jiyun is trying to run away. <laughs> it looks so cute. The feds got me to go out today. It would be a shame if I didn't show them this beautiful ocean, but I wouldn't have bothered to go if I were alone. I enjoyed going to the beach. But you only take one of them at a time I know, every other mommy. weekend. Beaches in the summer are always lively and fun. Okay, I think this is what she was doing. Mom, look, the sand castle! <laughs> oh, wait, that's a boy. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, wait, it works either way. A boy shattered his mom. I turned around and saw a family eating lunch together. Family. There we go. Here's when yeah. she was younger. Yeah, now we're in the sepia tone world. Look at the sand castle I made. Didn't I do a good job? I think that's her father. It looks great, daughter. Yeah, that's her father. This is her mother. Sure. Come have lunch. You'll get tired if you ha just keep playing without eating. Too bad our house is so far from the beach. I want to come here more often. In that case, let's come again next year. Really? His work for he's so busy that he doesn't even have vacations during the summer. But I still hope but he it... can come. I guess he must work like at a big business or something. I have no idea. I'll take some time off from work next year too. We'll come we'll come back. Really? You're the best daddy. We promised we'd come back the following year. But I never got but to he... spend the summer with dad again. But then he died. In a horrible freak boating accident or shark shark attack. Hey. That day. Something popped onto my lap. Meow. Oh man, Meow. I was really hoping. I was hoping it was a different animal. That was also a human. G U. Or G. Ah, I got myself confused again. Jiyun. I have no idea. He must have come to me in order to avoid G Su. G Su gave G Yun a look and growled something. G Yun's looking down on G Yun, or G Su with triumph and dies. Jiyun and Jihei sitting together in the shade look at the cats that I've said to call them pathetic. Jiwoo folded the ears of the side as if to silently protest against the cat's rocket. I gotta talk today. <laughs> what would those animals look like if they were human? They already have some interesting relations among themselves. The oh, you're gonna slide. find out. Oh, yeah, I agree. That will never happen, of course. So no, you say. Not. She's just digging her own grave at this point. Yep. And they all turn into humans. Things would be interesting. How would it feel if they looked at me with my eyes and talked to me like humans? Super awkward. Yeah. Would I be able to feel as relaxed with front of them as I, na as I am now? I'm gonna guess no. Of course this will, it'll never happen. But if it does, things would certainly be interesting. Yeah. It would be interesting and kind of awkward. Stress and pressure went up. Oh, I gotta get rid of the pressure. Okay, uh, August 1st. We're so close. I know. Oh, we get three hearts. To human aminals. We, we must we must seduce the aminals until they become human. <laughs> That's how it works, right? It's like the it's like the princess and the frog. You just uh, gotta give it a you gotta give it a big old smooch, and then they, and they become a human, Actually, right? Actually, it's kind of more like the Prince and the Frog, since, uh, considering what Jiyun is. Oh, considering he's an actual prince? Yeah. 
or I, the story's called The Frog Prince. The, the remake was the, the Princess and the Frog, I think. Ah. Yeah, because normally the Disney movies are based off of actual stories, like... Yep. Yeah, so all that of them, All of them. Yeah, Basically of the sense. same name as well. A lot of them are German fairy tales and do not end that way. And I, yeah, I don't have happy endings, actually. Like The Little Mermaid, for example. Mm-hmm. Pretty sure Goldilocks dies in the original Grim fairy tale. Really? I think so. I think she gets mauled by bears. I never read the, I haven't read the Grim fairy tale in a long time, so I might have well, to look us up. The original German fairy tales are really dark. Like, really, really dark. Oh, considering I think it's from Ger considering they're from Germany, that does not surprise me. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but... Uh, you would be right, they... <laughs> you, you touched him too hard. He, he looks sad. Okay, August 25th, we got... Uh, six days, I think, until then. Oh, but the... I think the German fairy tales are so, like... Horribly violent because instead of being like parables, they're supposed to be cautionary tales. That would make sense. Oh, stamp. Yay! And a book. Sweet. And see, no, we can only pick up three things. Oh, I see. You don't want to get that half-eaten cookie. Nope. Does it does it actually do anything, or is, does it just have as junk? It's basically merchant. It's not even merchant fodder. It doesn't cost, you don't get anything out of selling it. That's unfortunate. Actually, wait. I'll have her go to work. Just have something different happen. Because I've already got him up to max on points. Actually, let me check. We could have dated another one. Okay, I was just checking to see if it was still satisfied. Hey, that's fair. Okay, our stats are fine at the moment. Let's just go and check what he's doing. We are very feminine, but not very beautiful. Or skilled with our skilled with a paintbrush. Actually, I can get that up in a sec. It's probably okay. Uh, well, she no, probably needs to get her art skill up anyway. We we are decently skilled with uh, our artistry. We're we're not very beautiful though, apparently. Oh, I could always do something to increase that. Again, I think it's fine. If if the little bunny's satisfied, we're probably good. Yeah, because here we go. Beauty went up. It's because I wouldn't take very many baths unless I needed to get rid of the stress. <laughs> yes, that would make you uh, fairly less beautiful if you like didn't shower for weeks at a time. Agreed. Okay, finally, we can get the option to cook. Now we can do something in the kitchen. But I'm not going to the kitchen. Sounds good. I'm going to cover study. Uh... Really? Run into you again? I thought you hated me. Just making him upset every single time we see him. Yep. Okay, uh, let's just... He's got a heart, though. I think everybody does, except... The orange cat doesn't. Oh, this it... might be close. Gian. August is over now. School starts next Monday. Back to my no. usual busy life. Although I did get pretty busy with various activities during summer vacation, too. I didn't expect three months of vacation to pass by this quickly. I can't believe the second semester of my senior year is here already. It seems like yesterday when I first entered school. I'll be graduating soon. I can't even think of what kind of work I'd like to get after get into after graduation. So I'm planning on taking insufficient credits for graduation so I can attend school for one more semester. It sounds better to be called a college student rather than an unemployed person. I feel pathetic purposely delaying myself from going into society. But I really don't know. My major doesn't interest, interest me and neither does business, and I still don't know what I want to do. But I can't just get a job anywhere either. Others put off their decisions for the future by going abroad to study or studying at a law school. Am I going to end up becoming one of them? Maybe. I became independent from mom and moved to Busan to avoid that exact situation. I thought that as time passes, I would be able to find my dream and live with passion. I thought it would someday kind my calling. This is what I want to do. But that wasn't the case. A long time has passed and I still don't know what I want to do. So, that's why I'm even more afraid. That I'll be rejected by mom, by society, and eventually I'll be left behind alone. <sighs> Another endless route begins tomorrow. 
I don't have the courage to get out of that life yet. And here creepy. comes the wizard. Your line. I was going to say creepy wizard time? Yep. Hmm, you finally made your decision, I see. Aren't you feeling a little down? The climax of the game. Weird word choice. The climax of the game is just beginning. In his game and our game. Yeah, apparently. Good night, my heroine. I hope you like the present that I have for you. Wow. <laughs> 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 it's sorry. It's fine, it's fine. He's really creepy in my head. I yeah. just try to oh. trade that. Oh, it's a human. Yep, it's here. Human, whatever his name is, Gian, I think. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it, oh, that's me. Hey, hey, Jung. On my way home after the club activity is over, someone calls me from behind. Huh? It means someone. I, I, I really have a problem with how she doesn't like this guy. Like, he basically looks like a <laughs> Korean pop star anyway. <laughs> here. What's this? PJ has a heavy looking nuts. paper bag. Have some apples. My mom uh, bought too much again, and I don't think we can eat them all. Apples? PJ's mom tends to buy things too much often. Last yes. time, PJ gave me some oranges saying his mom bought too many. Clearly the reason. Thanks, this is really nice of you. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> Whatever the reason is, I'm thankful that PJ is thinking about me like this. Apples. Frankly, it's not my favorite fruit. The bag is pretty heavy. Can I really finish all this? Ah, I have three rabbits. They can eat it. They can eat the cute and rabbits, but we want to go home as soon as possible. One of them happens to like apples, especially. Yeah, considering that's all he ate from the last little scene. With and he's gonna be, he's gonna be human now, and it's gonna be super awkward. We're not gonna notice. I'm calling I'm it back. Now. The two cats look back and forth between me and the cat ball, while the two rabbits that are always <laughs> together turn heads to glance at me. Ji Woo, who was always alone, glanced at me for a second, but then soon turned his head away as if he's not interested in me, which he's not. With a hmph sound. Hmm, I wonder if rabbits like apples. I approached the rabbits, took one apple out of the bag, and laid it down on the floor. Here, it's an apple. Ji Hei and Ji Woo just stared at the apple on the floor. Are they not interested? Suddenly, Ji Yoon hops to where the apple is. He then circled around the apple. Whoa, he came close. Ji Yoon stood in front of the apple and looked up at me. The apple looks a little big next to Jiyoon. Would you like some apple, Jiyoon? I took the apple and went to the kitchen to grab a knife and a plate. Jiyoon followed behind me, as if he understood me. I was going to peel the apple and feed it to him in the living room, but I guess letting him eat on the kitchen, e eat in the kitchen will make it easier for me to clean up. I picked Jiyoon up and put him on the table. After peeling the apple, I sliced it into small pieces. It smells really sweet. It should be really good. Here. I gave Jiyoon a piece and he began eating it enthusiastically. He's so cute. I go to the sink to put the apple rind in the food disposer. I turned on the water to wash my hands that are sticky from cutting the apples. Should I give apples to the other rabbits too? She doesn't uh, eat the skin? Monster. Let's finally cut and bring them to the living room. Huh? As I look back after washing my hands... Here we go! It's a, it's a tiny hot guy. Well, this is awkward. Yep. Uh, <laughs> who? A boy whom I'd never seen before was sitting on the kitchen table. Who are you? White hair, red eyes, and... He has rabbit ears on his head. The rabbit ears. Yeah. Uh, what country? No, what planet is he from? What do you mean, what country? And how in the world is he sitting on my kitchen table? I... I changed? boy murmured with, with an expressionless face. He's wearing clothes that look something like a noble from the Middle Ages would wear. <laughs> unrealistic to be human. He looks like a moving doll. I know people can't see it, but it looks like uh, Jiyun is holding that saber from your uh, from the back, from your background. Oh, it changed. And his red eyes are exactly the same as Jiyun's. Wait a minute. Jiyun? Where is Jiyun? The boy with the rabbit ears are sitting where Jiyun was supposed to be. What? What's going on? It can't be that Jiyun turned into a human. But, but maybe. <laughs> are you Jiyun? No, you just ate some of your own cooking. I knew it was a stupid question, but I couldn't think of anything else right now. <laughs> yes? The boy whispered in a faint voice. Yes? What? 
Did he really turn into a human? The rabbit ears on his head. They're moving. No way. The ears are alive and moving? Are you really Jiyun? Did Jiyun really turn into a human? I asked again and the boy nodded silently. Don't tell me. Did he turn into a human by eating the apple? Yeah. <laughs> it was a magic apple. It's the one from Snow White. A rabbit turned into a human and even talks. Is that even possible? What happened to you? How can you eat an apple and become a human? It's not like a ma it's not a magic apple or anything. That's what you think. Was there something in the apples that Hijay gave me? Oh my god, maybe the wizard is Hijay. No way, that can't be the case. <laughs> that would be super awesome. <laughs> yes, it would. <laughs> Thank Rashley. Calm down. I, I just returned to my normal self as the time is up. What what time? What are you talking about? That's a good question. The exotic looking boy with the rabbit ears is talking in Korean. He's become impatient. He? Wow. <laughs> what are you talking about? Are you really Jiyun? The boy stopped talking. This is too much. He became a human before the, because the time's up? The last statement made me even more confused. A rabbit that turns into a human. And he even talks fluently in Korean when he looks nothing like a Korean. To be fair, our character also looks nothing like a Korean. True. <laughs> I've always been confused about that in anime. Do you have a good explanation for why uh, in animes, for some reason, people look white? I have no idea. What's going on? Were you a human from the beginning? You still Maybe answer. I was. Please tell me what's going on. Are you really Jiyun? I, I was an animal because that was the rule of the game. <laughs> this is what I really look like. Game? You call an animal becoming a human a game? What game? The rules of the game? You call an animal... Didn't okay. that happen? Uh... It, there, there are six participants in the game, including you. Wait, what happened? What is in front of his chest right now? Oh, it's a sleeve. Yeah. Uh, the, the fact that I'm back to my normal self means that you've made a decision. A decision? Wait a minute, did he just say I'm a participant of the game? I don't know anything about the game, explain to me what you mean. And what do you mean I made a decision? I didn't make any decision at all. Well, I've been dating you, White Bunny, super hard while you were still an animal. Jiyun closed Therefore, his mouth again. Therefore, that was my, that was my Please decision. Please tell me, I don't understand at all what you're talking about. I have no idea what's going on. The game? The participants? And my decision? It's a death game. I wish. <laughs> nope. That'd be, that'd be really terrible. That would be terrible as a dating sim. Agreed. To be in a death game. <laughs> Telling you more is against the rules. Rules? What rules? The rules of the game? Didn't she say that? Wasn't it like the third time she said that? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Telling you more is against the rules. That I said that before too. Jiyun so repeated the words monot monotonously as if he's a robot with no emotion. Against the rules? What's that supposed to mean? I don't know how I can just accept the situation. My pet suddenly became a human and talks? No one would believe this. Ugh. The boy stared at me. His eyes are beautiful like rubies, but they somewhat feel empty. You look confused. Of course she's confused! Yeah. If she wasn't confused, I'd say she's crazy! He talked without any sign of expression in his face. <laughs> you're, you're the heroine of this game. My role is to make you happy. What? The heroine of the game? Me? Jiyun jumped off the table. The others are there. Jiyun pointed to the living room. Wait, explain to me what you just said. Heroin? To make me happy? I don't understand any of this. What is this? As soon as I walked into the living room, I could not believe what I saw. What? Who are you guys? The player character's been living with five guys and she hasn't even known it. And everybody just... Awkward. Very awkward. <laughs> they look Turned really humans. They look really menacing in that picture. Agreed. This is too real to be a dream, and it's too much of a dream to be real. I don't have to touch the five patterns of ears to know that they're real. Completely discombobulated, I just froze. How I'm 
in a muddle here. No words coming out of my mouth. How can this be? Their unique clothes and exotic looks are certainly not of this world. <laughs> Look! He tongue is completely flustered. What? He knows my name? Orange hair. I've been here the whole time. <laughs> Steven smile. Wait, cat eaters. Is he do you? I've I've been in the bath with you. Oh god. Just never forget. Never forget. Like I said, I think that was in Jisoo's route that that pops up. <laughs> he only looks about 18 or so. Maybe it's because of his orange hair, but he seems a little bit like a juvenile delinquent. That's that's profiling right there. <coughs> Eddie. Yeah, like I said, that's his, re that's his actual real name. Okay. Jiyun mumbled something in a quiet voice and went over to a tall man and hugged him. The man with silver hair held Jiyun up as if they were used to it. You, see, you seem shocked. Of course she's shocked. Yeah. Long silver hair and clear blue eyes. It must be Jihei. Seeing a rabbit ears on his head made me feel like I'm dreaming. But he's like a moving porcelain doll. He's majestic. Oh, so majestic. <laughs> Damn wizard. He's a wizard? Oh, wait, no. They're talking about the pervert. Yeah. The black-haired man grumbled. His pointy ears were twitching a little. Eddie, that, that cat just said dance. <laughs> sure. Please be prudent not to become like him. Yeah. Okay. Ji Hai spoke in a small voice, but it was loud enough for Ji to hear. Tension arose between Ji Hai and Ji Su. I can hear you! <laughs> they all looked like friends when they were animals. Maybe they weren't that close? Didn't they not look like friends? She she commented that that there were like three groups of them. Ha! At least they were all quiet when they were animals. That's not true at all. A boy with speckled slash spotted rabbit ears, just like the ones Jibu has, spoke. Cats, rabbits, they're all too noisy. You're a rabbit too. I'm different from other rabbits. Can't you see my brown coat? Spotted. Spotted You're just coat. Spotted. You're just another rabbit after all. I don't want to talk to a carrot top like you. Seeing says the, blo like that says the blonde the person. Surface. Says the blonde person. Yep. This is all oh, this happened so suddenly. I have no clue as to what I should do. I have five guys in my living room. Just live it up. Hey, stop fighting. Kid, don't you say you're making the food giver uncomfortable? <laughs> food so, giver? Yeah. The person who gives food? Does he mean me? She does it really poorly, too. Technically, it's correct, but it sounds a little... The rabbit and the cat stopped quarreling and turned to look at me. I feel disconcerted with everyone's eyeing me. Uh... Did everyone change like this? Yes, the spell is broken! Everyone, Everything they're saying is just too hard to believe. So, are you gonna stay like this from now on? Even if there is such a thing as a, as a spell, and even if these guys are aliens from another planet, I can't have five guys living in my house. No, it's fine. I mean, together with five guys, what would people just, think when they find out? Just ignore it. It's fine. Oh, there's gonna be a really awkward line coming up you're gonna have to say. Is it by HJ? No, Jiwoo. Oh, okay. That cannot happen. You're not happy we changed for? Ears drooped. Oh. Not all. He was perving on you. His eyes Remember. Up. Never forget. No, but the house is too small for six people, and plus, plus, and what? What is it? What would the people think if they found out? And there we go. There we go. Stupid cat. She's saying the things like. Basically. Like, bleeping and bleeping might happen if we live together. <laughs> yeah, sure. like I said, awkward. No, it's fine. Well, he, she already touched his little pink paw, remember? I mean, she's already gotten, like, halfway and there with... He's already give it, been giving ba uh, ji Yoon baths. Yeah, so she's gotten, like, halfway everything. there with half of, the, half of the cast. What? What did he just say? Did I hear him right? I can hide my shock. <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> and, 
Eddie, what what's blank in blank? <laughs> I'm not gonna make up words. I could though. Yeah, you could. Well, well, that's. Wait. No, I'm curious. Two. Wait, I'm curious why there's two. I I mean, I can for sure guess one thing. What is the second thing? Uh, I don't think I want to know. <laughs> Just... <laughs> hey, you don't have to worry about things like blank and blank. I basically can't stop right. It was ready to explode. Oh, good. You're not my type at all, so don't worry. <laughs> That's not what I was talking about. <laughs> it, it's unbelievable how you can make such a rude remark so casually. It's okay. It's not to say that you're plain looking. Anyway, trust, trust us. Hey, you were the one perving on me in the bath. <laughs> true. You're a little orange cat. That's true. If you worry about having all of us in this tiny house, no one's forcing you. We're, we're going to stay animals as long as nothing goes wrong. Yeah, they can sh now that the spell's broken, they can uh, change from yeah. human forms to animal forms if they have to. Uh, okay. Tiny house? But it's pretty big for one person. Yeah, it seems really, really big. Uh, my lady. The lady? Me? The man who I assume to be J.I. lowered his eyes. We'll do our best not to inconvenience you in any way. Does that mean they're going to keep living in my house? Wait, so are you guys animals or men? Well, we're actually... Um... How Please explain, explain it! Funny? <laughs> Please. Don't ask me, stupid. I don't know. Tell us... We can turn ourselves into animals or humans, whichever you want. Wait, wait. I cut you see you off. I cut you see you off. Where in the world are you from? Are you even from this planet? Oh. This is a drastic problem. The situation doesn't make any sense, but calm down. Take a deep breath. No matter what, no matter how much I try to calm myself down, people are not supposed to turn themselves into animals. No, we're from far away. Far away? Where is that? Well, how can I explain? Everyone suddenly became quiet. It's as if no one wants to talk. Gee, thanks for explaining that so, so it's well, as if guys. I asked something I shouldn't have asked. They all look at each other, hesitating to talk. We can't tell you that. Those are the rules. Rules? What rules? Rules? What are you talking about? We can't tell you that either. Why? Because those are the rules. Great. This is really frustrating. Yeah. My I have thoughts no idea exactly. who these guys are, or where and where they're from. They won't tell me a thing. I have no idea what to do. Ugh. I was living such an ordinary life. Why did such a thing happen to me? Why me of all people? Hey, you don't like us? No, it's not that. How can I so casually accept that my pets have turned into humans? Hey, food giver. Jisoo looked at me with a concerned expression. Why did you guys suddenly appear? Who left you in my room? I, I'm sorry, but we can't tell you that. Why? The rules. I had to answer again. Why me? Yes. Why is it me of all people? That's because... Jisoo hesitated. I looked straight at him waiting for an answer. Tell me. Why did this happen to me? Well, We're there's chosen. this... Well, there's this really old... Uh, there's this weird magic dude creeping on you. Chosen? What do you mean? <laughs> Who chose me? Jisoo overwhelmed my eyes. You can't tell me that either? Jisoo nodded slowly. Oh, well, he's kind of a pervert. Don't get mad. Please. It's just, I'm just frustrated by the fact that they won't tell me anything. I'd be frustrated too. The whole situation is just too overwhelming. It's not like I could talk to someone about this. I might come to terms with it that they provided they tell me everything, but they all keep their mouths shut like it's all some sort of secret pact among them. They're not gonna throw us out, right? Ji Yoon looked at me with his big, sad, puppy eyes. Puppy eyes? I figured it'd be coming from Ji Soo, anything. <laughs> the right thing to do would be to kick these guys out and go back to life as it was before. I volunteered to take care of five small and helpless animals, not five guys. <laughs> well, it may seem a bit harsh, I had no choice but to ask them to leave. Otherwise, I would never be able to return to my normal life. Yes, I should go back to how things were before, as if nothing ever happened. How things were before. 
I won't have to waste time anymore. Instead, I'll be able to spend more time for myself. I can go back to my busy everyday life. But is that really the life I want? I remembered how joyful my last three months in the company of the animals have been. Although I was busy and tired from school and after school, after school school, coming home to them relieved me of my situation. That is not, that's not a good translation of that. I know. I enjoyed thinking about what activities I do with the animals during the weekend. And even if the house got a little messy, even if taking care of them took away from a lot of my time, I enjoyed having them. With them I laughed a lot. With the animals, the old boring day-to-day -day life became fun. The animals that greeted me whenever I came home are these people. These are the, they are the, they are those animals. Actually, I don't want to go back to how things were before. Hats. Huh? What? No. You should all wear hats or hoodies to hide your ears whenever you go out. And don't make loud noise at home. And during evenings and when there's nothing special going on, you should stay as animals. Why can't, we can't have the neighbors suspecting something. And you're prohibited from coming into my room during bedtime. Food giver, you don't ever have to worry about that. An annoying cat. The annoying sexy cat. <laughs> you might stay here as long as you follow those rules. Thank you. Don't worry, we won't cause you any harm. Cool, thank you. But what's what, what's a hoodie? I don't know. Just say thanks, Bunny. <laughs> don't call me Bunny. <laughs> Young Master. Yes, thank you. I guess this is how things will be before I can come up with a good solution. Animals will turn into humans. No one would believe this. You already got that right. And now that, that we've gotten that uh, long cutscene out of the way, I think we yeah. need to end this part off here. I was going to suggest that, yes. And we will see you guys next time. And if Dandelion Wish is brought to you when we finally get some actual Action. normal, somewhat, somewhat normal Action stuff. from hot guys. Actual Just go with it. Actual normal stuff happening. Sure. Considering we have guys that could turn into humans. Yeah, Man. sure, normal. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.